Hey YouTube, Stillborn86 here with a quick Arduino myth video. Um, I've seen online where people discuss pin 13. Let me show you here. If I can get the light correct. Pin 13 right here. Um, right there. They, a lot of people believe that pin 13 has a resistor in line with it since this L LED is tied into pin 13. Um, the argument is that there's a pin that comes off of the microcontroller, goes to the LED, and then goes to pin 13. And since the LED for L right here must be resisted, pin 13 must be resisted as well. And so you see a lot of people do some goofy stuff like this here, anode, cathode, cathode on this side, they'll throw an LED in just like this. Since there's a ground and pin 13 together, since, there's a since they believe there's a resistor on pin 13, they can throw an, an LED here. Since there's a resistor here, there's power going through a resistor into 13 and into the ground. I'm here to tell you that that's not true. That's not even close to true. Um, and you will burn your LEDs out this way because you are throwing too much voltage with no resistance into the, um, the equation because of Ohm's law of V over R equals I. Since there is zero for R, current I is going to be infinite and you will burn up your LEDs. So enough with the math. Let's, uh, let's look at this really quickly and uh, let's prove that there is no resistor on pin 13. To do that, I'm going to use this multimeter here. You can see that it's set on resistance, so when I touch, it goes to zero because there's no resistance between the two terminals, okay? And with this cable here, when I touch both ends together, it also goes to zero because there's no resistance on this jumper, okay? That being said, let's throw this jumper onto pin 13. Okay, it's on, I don't know if you can see that or not. Actually, it's on the ground. I can't see it. <laughs> pin 13, right there. Okay, jumper on pin 13. I also have a jumper on my Leonardo for pin 13. And just to show you that they are tied to this LED, I'm going to run this quick sketch here where I'm going to blink pin 13 to show you that pin 13 actually is attached to that LED. So let's go ahead and upload. Let me get some flashing lights. Yada, yada, yada. Transfer, receive. Let's throw the ground on here. And as you can see, that L LED right there is flashing with the LED that's tied to pin 13. So let's, let's pull in a little bit closer here. If it'll focus, maybe not. Can we get it to focus? The lights are driving it crazy, I think. There we go. So the jumper's on 13, there's a ground, and the L LED is flashing with pin 13. Okay? So, 13. All right, that being said, let's, let's go ahead and disconnect power really quickly, because we don't need that anymore. Um, and we need this and not the ground. So now that we have pin 13 jumpered on both boards, actually let's clear up some more space. Now that we have pin 13 jumpered to both boards, let's, uh, let's look at things really quickly. Um, if you look at the schematics for either board or for for let's 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 work with the uno first if you look at the schematics for the uno you will notice that pin 5 is connected to the l led and it's also connected to pin 13 so we're going to count one two three four five okay make contact here let's see if we, let's actually okay so one two three four five and let's look at the l led 
So we'll get about 2,000 ohms um, of resistance for that. Okay, let's do it again. Mm, just, just, just shy of 2,000, about 1,900 ohms. So that's good. That is resistant. Now if we come over here to the jumper, to pin 13, we notice that it goes down to zero. So we are connected to this pin on the microcontroller, but there's no resistance here, okay? And if we come over here for the, art, for the Leonardo, we will find out, I don't know what the best way to do this one is because the pins are so small, we'll find out that pin 32, find it there. Pin 32 is connected to the LLED. And again, we're getting about, let me put this in camera, we're getting roughly 2,000 ohms. 1,800, almost 1,900 ohms, right? And that's the LLED. But if we come over here to the jumper, which is connected to pin 13, if I can get a hold of it, uh... Man, I'm going full retarded day. If I get the jumper, it goes straight down to zero. Okay? So that's that's definitive physical proof that pin 13 has no resistor on it. Okay? And just to show you that, that this does work, I've got, if we can focus here, I don't know if you can see the colors for that resistor there, but they are 220 ohm resistors. Looks like I've got... Two reds, a purple, and a gold, maybe? I don't know, I can't tell with this this light. But they're, they're, I know that they're 220 ohm resistors. And just to show you that this does work, uh, if I can get this on here. Er, 217, 220, right there. Oh, it's not focusing. Of course it's not focusing. There we go. So we're looking at about 220 ohms for this resistor, which is what it should be, okay? So my multimeter works. Both of these are connected to pin 13. And I guess the only thing left is to show you that I did use the correct pins on the Arduino. Um, this here is the schematic for the Uno board. And if we go down here, where are we? We see here that PC2, pin 5, goes to nothing because it comes up here and picks up at 5 and comes down. It splits. And 1 goes to 13, pin IO13 right here. And then it splits here into a 1K resistor into this ground it threw the yellow L LED so pin 13 is not resisted but the LED is and if we go and then again this is this is the fifth pin on the Uno you could test that out yourself if we go to the Leonardo things are a little bit more complicated pin 32 here is input output 13 and where did I hide 13 here IO13 goes into here where you get 1k resistor to just the just the yellow LED and then ground. Okay? So again, there are no resistors for pin 13. Um you cannot simply hook up uh LED to pin 13. Let me get this this way. You can't simply hook up an LED to pin 13 because of the fact that there's no resistance to it. Um, thank you very much for watching. This is Stillborn86. Have a nice day.